guys and welcome back to my channel god's grace interiors i would like to say welcome back to all my old subscribers also to my new subscribers and for those of you all who will be signing on to be a part of god's grace i would like to say welcome as well i would like to thank you guys for uh allowing me the time to try to get things together i thank you guys for your patience and so we're going to go forth on tonight for this long awaited 2020 master bedroom tour and I hope you guys enjoy. Entering into my bedroom, you'll see on the left-hand side these two oil paintings of my grandbaby. Those have been there for a while. Those of you all who have uh, viewed previous bedroom tours, those have been there um, for a while. Uh, I believe in each one of my tours, they have been there as, as well as these uh, different items on my chest of drawer, my perfume, and my jewelry. So I'm not going to spend too much time here. And upon decorating um, my master bedroom uh, this time around, I tried to pull in some more, uh, as usual, the neutral tones. But I also wanted some more earthy tones as well. So you'll notice a lot of the uh, different beiges and the bronzes a lot of rock elements and everything and a lot of stone and I, that's what i wanted to achieve uh for warmth and also for uh, a touch of relaxation because this is our bedroom and so as you uh enter in and you'll notice the different textures and furs along with all different types of things that i uh, use and i hope that you all would agree that i accomplished what i was trying to achieve with this look Now, in uh, placing my throw pillows, I wanted to do a layered look so you would be able to see each and every pillow as you stood in the uh, front of the pillows all the way from the back, from that beige fur pillow to the gray to the large velvet pillow and even the toss pillows in the front. And you'll notice from the front, you can see each and every layer. And that's the look I was trying to achieve. Oh, you guys, I absolutely positively adore these new lamps. Uh, I needed a lamp with a little bit more height. In my previous bedroom tours, you'll notice the lamps I have, though they were gorgeous, they were just too short uh, to achieve the look that I needed in this area. And so these lamps here with the brass bottom uh, for the warmth, I love that brass uh, look. And um, I love the height on these, and I think they achieved exactly what I needed them to do. What do you guys think? I also absolutely adore that acrylic bottom on the uh, base of these lamps. I just really love these lamps, you guys. Okay, you guys, as we move behind the lamps here, you'll notice these gorgeous, uh, elegant curtains here. Uh, I picked these up from Burlington's, and I also did a haul on this. I believe these were also in that same haul, and um, I'm loving these. They're picking up on the bronze uh, tones that I have in this room that has that paisley design, and I'm really loving these here.
Now you guys will uh, also notice these gray uh, pillows with the beading on the front. Those are actually pillow covers that I purchased from Amazon. And um, I did a tour on the, I mean not a tour, a shopping haul on these. And I'll link that above for you guys in case you haven't had a chance to look at it. But I love the way they're at, those are also blending in with this neutral vibe. The sand colors, the beiges, and the gray. Oh, it makes such an awesome, awesome statement. Okay, let's talk about this beautiful tray. Actually, this tray is actually the top off an, off an ottoman uh, that I have by the Inspire Me Home Collection. Um, now, on top of the tray, you'll notice this gorgeous bronze flower that I picked up from Pier 1. I also uh, showed that in the same haul, shopping haul. Uh, in the back there, I have a actual candle holder that came from Bath & Body Works with those uh, gray stones on them. Inside of that candle holder, I have some gorgeous off-white uh, flowers there uh, that I believe I picked those up from Burlington's a while back. Uh, also notice that single bloom there that's actually a floral uh, reed diffuser oil diffuser and that's also in that same shopping haul as well I picked that up from home goods that candle a DW home candle I believe I got that from Burlington and that gorgeous box with the agate stone on top that came from um, pure one Now let's talk about what's on this nightstand over here. I mean, real still enjoying this uh, candle holder I purchased, leaf candle holder I purchased from Bath and Body Works. I've had it over here since the fall season, and I'm still really enjoying that. That's another DW Home candle that I've had in previous room tours, and I love that brass accent on the front. It blends in so well with the look that I'm trying to achieve in this area. Another one of these gorgeous lamps is on this side, and that large reed diffuser in the back I also uh, showed that also in that uh, same shopping haul that I linked um, just moments ago in this video you'll also notice this gorgeous little uh, glass stand trim with the uh, gold leaf I've had this over here for some time as well. It's been there since uh, other room tours, and I'm loving that. On top of this Elements book that was purchased from Amazon a while back, and there are my heart uh, marble coasters that I don't think I will ever part with. I love having them over here still as well. Over here in this corner of the room, you'll notice this gorgeous uh, candelabra floor uh, lantern here. Uh, I've had this for some time. I just simply moved some things around in my home because I normally have that in my front room. And uh, that bronze, I wanted to tie that bronze in and bring the candles in for warmth. So it goes so well in this area. On top of the books, you'll see that I, ha I have that cheetah there that I did purchase. Uh, and I showed that in a previous haul. On top of the books, and I'm loving him. He is something fierce. Uh, that gorgeous uh, vase back there, I purchased that from Pier 1. I also uh, showed that in my last shopping haul. Um, those flowers, well-known flowers from Z Gallery, I've had those for some time. And my famous, my infamous horse head over there that I purchased from Pier 1 a while back, who often appears in many of my videos, there he is again, you guys. And everything is blending in with this gorgeous uh, print that I have on the wall that I got dirt cheap from Ross. I am so loving this area, you guys. Those two large ceramic canisters in the background, y'all have seen those before in previous room tours. Those came from Z Gallery.
And on top of my settee here, you'll notice I have these fur pillows here. I don't ever think I'll do away with my fur pillows. And I have one addition to the bunch, and that's that long oblong pillow, that lumbar pillow right there in the middle. I purchased that from Target. I also have that in that same shopping haul, you guys. If you haven't had a chance to check it out, please check it out. But yeah, my fur pillows, I love, love, love. So that's what I have on top of the settee here. On top of my velvet ottoman here that I have in front of my settee, I, you'll notice on this gorgeous bronze tray here that I have a vase here with these gorgeous flowers that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. Uh, this candle here, I'm loving that as well. Uh, this um, gorgeous mirror with the rock bottom that you're seeing here. I purchased that from Home Goods. I did a shopping haul on that as well. This bronze candle is blending in so nicely. You can get a better view of that vase on the left. I purchased that from Pier 1 and I'm loving that. These are gate stone coasters. I've had those for a while i don't think i'll ever part with those you guys and it has the uh gold trimming on the edging edging of those bringing in all of the metallics and all of the rustics and all of the uh nice uh neutral tones i'm just loving that and those matches i love those because they also blend it went blend in with my decor as well and i purchased those from marshall's and i dare not forget about my most famous and uh my special beads there with the cross that i love so much you guys know where they came from those came from kirkland's and i'm still loving those Thank you guys for watching my 2020 master bedroom revamp tour. And um, if you all have not subscribed to God's Grace Interiors just yet, I would love to have you to my old and new subscribers. I would like to say thank you again. And you all be blessed. And as I always say, stay blessed in the Lord. Bye-bye. Until the next time.